She's a little dark and cloudy today, but we got a little rain early this morning, but nothing now. So we're gonna try and be productive as possible. Justin, keep it down over there. <laughs> Anyways, what's up guys? How's it going? Mark Freeman 408 here. Make sure you subscribe and hit notifications because we do eight videos a week. Yes, I said at eight videos a week. We do two on Tuesdays. So I do Toby Tuesday, where I answer uh, questions with fans and whatnot. And then I also post some craziness too. So our plan for today, I hope you guys enjoyed that Maverick uh, yesterday, the 200 horsepower machine, because that thing was amazing. But today, we're gonna turn the shocks around on this thing. Hey Justin, how's it going? Bad, not bad. Not good? Not good? Not bad. You uh, merch plugged already? Merch plugs? Yeah. I got my Canadian as fuck shirt on. It's a little worn out. I've worn it too many times. But uh, yeah. Anyways, the shocks. So stock, they come like this. They have the reservoirs on the inside. I don't know why they do that. But you can flip them around and then you just got to kind of trim this. They already rub actually right there. But you can flip them around and it looks way meaner. So I like it. Yeah, so anyways, but before that, we're going to head down to the track. I got eight cars down there, five of them I own. So we're going to cut all the uh, Cadillac converters off them, and we're going to take them to the scrap. We're going to get some cash for those, and then use that cash for more cars. So, Well, we're going to attempt to take them off. I don't know how it's going to go. It always sounds easy in our heads, but it ends up being a three-hour job. So First try. First try? First try. Just hook them up and yank them off, so... This is my new paddle board. What do you guys think? Pretty dope. All right, you got the tools? Uh, 10 snips. Right, love 10 that. snips. It should be in the toolbox. Anyways, let's head down the track. We'll grab the skid steer and uh, see what we can do. Got that trailer on. Yeah. Hello, Crawford. You got the old ankle hook up? Hey Crawford, how's it going? So Crawford is blind in one eye. You know why he's blind? Because he saw something so spectacular that it blinded him. He actually saw Justin naked. Justin, you blinded that horse, eh? That's why he's blind in one eye. How did I blind him? He saw you naked. <laughs> That'd do it, eh? I have no argument. <laughs> no comment at this time. No comment. All right, we got one up here. We just used our new cutters. Let's see those things, Justin. So Justin convinced me to buy these off Amazon. It's and they work really good. Hook in like that? Yeah. If I can get to go in. You hook her in like that, squeeze it, and just... And start working it back and forth. Geez, we're gonna teach everyone on YouTube how to steal cats. So, I got that cut right there. Took me about 30 seconds. Now we gotta get the one up here. I think we can just unbolt it though, so let's get her off. So here's how the professionals do it. We couldn't get right behind the engine. That's where it uh, fastens. So we cut half off, we hooked the strap up to it, and then we hooked it to the Buick. This is how the pros do it. Don't hit my truck. <laughs> Will it work? Oh. My knot kind of came undone. I guess we should have put it in park too. <laughs> wow. Thing is on there. We probably, probably should have took it out of neutral. Yeah, I probably should have put it in park. I wonder if we come at it at an angle, that would work better. That's good. <laughs> Let me throw it in park. Attempt number two. I don't think that strap's gonna hold. We'll find out though. <laughs> that thing is on there. Apparently it didn't want to go in park either. Hey! Yay. That was easy. It's a cat. It doesn't Hello. look like a cat. No. It's funny because that end's not even tied up. It's just kind of sitting over the top. Huh. I wonder how this thing's gonna sound now. So. Straight pipes. Straight pipes. All right, one down, four more to go. <laughs> the first there time. wasn't a condition requirement, was there? Uh, I don't think so. Okay, I don't think you're gonna be able to bolt this back on. No, that that thing is that thing is off the loop. 
All right, next up. Next up, PT Boozing Cruiser. <laughs> Let's see what we can do. Car number three. Be good. Where is this cat at? Oh, yeah, right up there. All right, round two. Let's see what we got. Let's see if we can break the strap. <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> Works like a charm every time, eh? This Buick, they should have made these things in diesels because they're a tank. Yeah. Tank City. Oh yeah, you wrapped it right around the front. Oh yeah. Good thing I got the strap on sale for like 20 bucks. Well, should we bang out one more? Yeah, got the yeah. Subaru? It's holding up pretty good. I mean, it's not ideal, but it might just be a designated uh I'm interested to see how loud this thing is, you know? Yeah. You wanna start it up? I think it's gonna call and just cut the front off and then rip it out. Yeah. I don't think you could cut the other part off anyway. Oh my God, this thing's gonna be so loud. Buick. Oh man, we're having too much fun today. <laughs> that is awesome. Alright, one more car. We'll do the Subaru now. Alright, number three, the old Subaru. Let's rip her off. You gonna dump her down or you wanna her Yeah, I'll dump her down. Alright, don't let us down, Justin. <laughs> she might be a triple puller. Yeah, pump some diesel into that thing. <laughs> Something broke. I think it broke off. Broke the strap, I think. Now we got a hole in it. I don't know how it, it must have slid off. That's weird. Yeah. I thought you said that one was fully secure. It was fully secure. <laughs> Apparently, Subarus are built tough. Apparently. What's the BMW? <laughs> that thing is on there. Holy! She just doesn't. What's that? It's just two rusted bolts. Can Maybe try, it again? try. Yeah, try going that way though. Don't hit the beamer. Take a hard left. Yeah, we don't want to scratch it. Yeah, don't don't scratch the beamer. Whew! It is hot out. Muggy, that's for sure. What are we doing here? Watch the whole engine comes out. <laughs> where are you going? I don't think he even knows where he's going. <laughs> Give her a pull. <laughs> that thing is on there. Keep pulling, 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 pulling. Oh. <laughs> Keep her going, don't get stuck out there. <laughs> oh, 
Oh man, hilarious. I don't know if that one's gonna come off. <laughs> hey -o. Third time's a charm. We completely ruined the strap, but I got it on sale anyway, so. <laughs> taking, her, taking the cat for a walk. Jokes. What are you doing? What are you doing, buds? Hey. To be Tuesday. All right. Fire the thing up. So we got the we got about three cats, three out of the five cars. So I left the one on the BMW and the Mercedes. Just figured we keep them on there for now. But uh, then it started raining for a bit. But now we're gonna switch the shocks around on the Mav. See how she goes. All right, you got your tripod? Yeah, probably. Tripod, you probably need a, a knife and a heat gun. Hot knives. We got this uh, fancy little tree here. Ryan won't let us use the shop. Yeah, we are kicked out of the shop already, so. We don't need them anyway, we got a tree. Hey. Winch her up. Apparently this didn't stay up. Boom. Just like that. You good? Good. I'm good. I'm good if you're good, so we're good. All right, well, we got them off. Wasn't too bad. I had to run back and grab the Makita. And the golf cart. And the golf cart, because you know, golf carts just make life so much easier. Oh, room in here, right? Eh? You know what, let's just run it like this. That looks strong. Oh, that's just a uh, support. Uh, this is actual metal. What's this wire here? Ding. A brake light. Oh, bugs out here. All right, let's uh, turn these things around, throw them back in, and uh, start cutting. A little shine. Spit shine. And the shocks are in. Yeah, that looks way better. We need to be cleaned up a little, but we'll trim around here, bring her back to the garage. Should we, see, should we winch this thing up in the tree, Justin? One in Rome. One in Rome? Should you throw it in neutral? It's in neutral. <clears throat> you want to grab that heat gun? Yeah. <laughs> Hurry up. <laughs> up the tree. Oh, it's this whole branch. Well, you might not want to stand under that branch. <laughs> up and up we go. Up and up we go. Oh yeah, that's a strong branch. <laughs> there. I probably wouldn't walk under there, but... Uh, Oh, yeah, that's how we'll wash the Maverick from now on. Hey, stand underneath there. Do the squat like you're in the band. Arms out. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> All right, let's lower this thing down and get those plastics trimmed up and we'll finish up the video. That's what the underside looks like, guys. Not too bad at all. Gotta drill some more holes in there for so when it drains out. Cool. Nope. Heat her up. Heating the knife, heating the knife. I got bugs in my hair. Don't care. Don't care. So this isn't helping, this heat gun, because I'm sweating. No, okay. Hold on. Whatever. Old hot knives. Oh, that's gonna 
I feel like that's just gonna spring and hit me right in the face. Probably. There. So it's done, boys. Oh yeah. Good oh, pushing it. You quit pushing me closer to the edge. I feel like I'm, I'm like an old pro. And modified. Race ready. I didn't want to slam it down too hard. Yeah. <laughs> Race ready, eh? Sometimes yeah. you just gotta trim a little plastic. So trim a little plastic, make slap a couple fans. stickers on, and you sometimes, go way faster. Sometimes stickers make it go a million miles faster. So. How close are those pieces together? Are they pretty consistent or did you screw them up? Nope, oh, I went a little longer on the one. Mm. But you know, now it's just a chewed boot. You won't even notice if like, ooh, ooh. Do you trim your plastics? Like if you're standing here, you're not gonna be looking right there, so who cares? I am. Anyways, that was fun. Thank you guys for watching. Um, check out the merch store. Covering crap. They don't come this faded. <laughs> yeah, I've just washed this one a million times. Um, yeah, so we're gonna see what other trouble we can get into tonight. It was supposed to be a rain day, so I was thinking it was gonna be an office day, but it hasn't really rained once yet today, so. Yeah, it's just been kind of sprinkling, but not even that. It's just yeah, like, just enough to. Anyways, mm. thank you guys as always. Leave some comments below if you have any suggestions for videos or collaborations you wanna see. Let us know, I'll message them, see if we can hook something up. Get ready for next week. We got Daily Driven Exotics, Damon and Dave coming down. So that's gonna be pretty exciting stuff. They're shipping the Lamborghini from BC to here. So we're not just, we're not just racing the old Ford around the track. The Lamborghini is coming here. So I'm pretty excited. I hope you guys are excited and uh, yeah. Enjoy the rest of your week and have a fantastic long weekend for the Canadians. And uh, just have a fantastic weekend in general. We'll see you guys later.